Aha! Howdy, partners! How are we? Scott O'Clear live on a Friday night just for you, saying dinky do. I hope you're well and that you've had a good week and all is going your way. Tremendous stuff. So there we go. A little bit more light for you. Excellent. There we are. That's what we like. You can't beat a good bit of light shining on McClure, I say. And uh, it's Friday evening. Nothing is past me. Early in the evening, you'll be at your tea. You'll be getting up to all sorts of things. But I thought I'd just pop up and see how hi and uh, find out what's been happening this week so there you go and of course if you can all spread the word i don't actually have any shared devices with me right now i haven't got my shared facilities so you will have to do all the hard work not a problem man friday david gardner you are man friday indeed lovely to have you with us if you'd like a wee shout out of course come and join me and share it here to share the wonderful gordon stillings there how you get on with your pumps gordon uh, hello scotty is this joshua dinky do joshua hello McLean. Hello, says Gordon Stilly. Excellent to have you with us, Gordon. Hi, Scotty, says Ian McManus. Dinky do. Friday night, Cameron Filson, Rob Randall. Come on, come and join us. McClure's here. McClure is in town. And spread the word. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 about Scott McClure's Friday night pop up just for you. Live on Facebook Live. Evening, Mr. McClure, says Davy Rutherford. Evening, Davy. Lovely to have you with us. And Dinky do. Ron King. Nice to have you with us as well. Laura Devlin's there watching, and the wonderful Gordon Roddick is watching as well. Excellent. Hope you're well, Gordon. Dinky Doo from Scotty McClure, one of the finest broadcasters we have. Um, hi Scotty, how are you, says David Carr Excellent David Hello Scotty from Kinloch Bervy In the Highlands, excellent uh, When are you taking over from Mrs May, Scotty? Mrs May is doing a fabulous job I don't know what all the hoo-ha is about Two and a half years since the referendum And um, all is well, we are still in the EU So a result, I would say Success in my book uh, The shot matches the bonnet, Scotty of course, we like to tidy ourselves up and follower of fashion, aren't I? Dedicated follower of fashion. So there you are, Alistair. You'll never go wrong with McClue's garb, McClue's outfit. This is duck egg. I don't know what you're actually getting, but it's duck egg blue. Uh, tell us what colours you're seeing in your, uh, in your uh, device from your Facebook Live device. Do let me know. The wonderful Mike Henfield's watching. Dinky you do, Mike. Lovely to know you're there. I hope you're well and love to you and your wonderful family. Ned McMillan. Hello, Scotty. Dinky do. Hello, Ned. I hope all is well with you. Friday night, of course. Everybody gets together. A clue pops up on Facebook Live. No harm in that. Dinky do, Scotty. Says Scott Biddy. Hazel Smith says hello. Hello, Hazel. Lovely to have you with us on a Friday evening. Can you guys do all the sharing? Because I haven't brought my share device with me. Councillor Henry Anderson, Dinky Do, David Niggas, Dinky Do, lovely to have you with us. Tremendous. But uh, if you all share and share and share, let everybody know McClure's on. Brown and white and black, says Alistair King. Is that the uh, jump art? Or is that the bonnet? Or is that the, uh, the shot? What are we talking about? To what are we referring, Alistair King? One asks. So there we are. Uh, don't forget that I'm live tonight on Nation Radio 96.3 FM if you're in Scotland or www.nationradio.scot. Hello, Scotty, says Andy Hughes. Hello, Andy. Welcome. I hope you've all had a good week and a very big dinky do to you. Oh, my nose is bothering me. I wonder if we can do a bit of sharing, but it might mean having a wee kick round the corner. You know what I mean? That sort of thing. Honk, honk, Andy, says Scott Beady. Didn't you do the shot, pal? Says Alistair King. Brown and black. Excellent. Very, very good. So obviously your colours are pretty good. Susie Starlight, didn't you do honk, honk, Scott? Says Andy. Andy Hughes is um, big 
Trucker, big trucker, of course, with a TR. Fantastic stuff. And uh, he's honk honk to all his mates on the road, letting them know that Scotty McClue's live on Facebook Live for World Unity, saying dinky do to every single one of you. Don't forget, as I say, we're on the radio tonight, 10 o'clock sharp, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, 10 till midnight, Nation Radio 96.3 FM. That's the big one. And it's a phone in at Scotty McClue's nightline, um, 0141. 8110475 get yourselves on and let's hear from you and is giving us a thumbs up thumbs up to you Andy Land Dinky Doo Michael Peverell Dinky Doo Thomas Hamilton lovely to have you with us Friday night see things don't get past me McLean knows exactly what he's talking about one or two idiots on this week uh, not on here, of course, I hasten to add, but on things that we've posted, the keyboard warriors, we had to blank one or two of them because they were a wee bit out of order. Here's Thomas Hamilton. Hello, pal. Hope you've had a good week. Thomas, I have. I've had a fantastic week. And dinky-doo to every single one of you, I say. I hope you've had a good week. And if you've got challenges and if you're struggling, I hope... All is going well with you. If anybody knows uh, Sir George from Clermeister, uh, then send him my very, very best regards, Sir George. Remember, Sir George used to ring us on the talk show in Edinburgh, Sir George of Clermeister. He was a massive jambo. So there you are. This is his story, and this is his song. And he's not been too well recently, so we send him lots of strength and lots of love. There we are, Kelvin Allen. Thank you, do. Lovely to have you with us, of course. Excellent stuff. And uh, Mark Gippert has joined us. Now, Mark, I'm a big fan of yours, and I have a suspicion that you're a big fan of Scotty McClue. And we like that, of course. Scotty McClue has billions of fans the world over. So there you are. Nay small drink is your man McClue. I can tell you that. What are you talking about tonight, says Thomas Thomas? As you well know, that's embargoed until the show starts. Otherwise, the opposition might get a hold of the topics and start using them for their own shows. There you are. So we do have to um, urge caution. Caution, I would say. Caution. That's the one. Ian Johnson, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Excellent stuff. Uh, Anne Early, how nice to have you with us. Excellent stuff, Anne Early. A very warm welcome. Can we get sharing and sharing and sharing as quickly as you possibly can? Get these numbers up. Come on. The whole world should be watching McClue when he pops up. John Cameron's there. Ha ha, pal, says Thomas Hamilton. Of course, Thomas. So there you are. We have to keep a secret on here. We have to keep this between you and I and the rest of the universe. Good evening, sir, says John Cameron. Indeed, John Cameron. A very good evening to you from me, Scotty McClue. We're live on Facebook Live. We're global. This is the big one. Dana Pals says Thomas. Excellent, Thomas. Thank you. Hi, Scotty, says Ian Johnson. Hi, Ian. Hiya, big Polly Wally. How are you this fine evening? I'm just back from the bake house. Oh, Oh, Mahir, you'll be smelling of fresh bread. And I hope you brought some dough home with you. Ha! Do you get it? Because we're all needing the dough. Do you know what I mean? I'm needing the dough. <laughs> oh, everyone and Jim, McClue's on fire. How excellent is that, Dinky Doo? Jilly Shaw, lovely to have you with us. Scotty McClue saying Dinky Doo to every single one of you. Thumbs up and a few hearts from you. Tap, 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 on your screen. Let's know you're watching. Kevin McDade is watching Dinky Doo to you. Scotty, do you have a wee triple at the weekend? And if you do, what's your preference? Scott Beattie, I used to have a wee triple until about three years ago and I decided to wrap it in when they brought in the absolutely zero tolerance and I thought to myself you have to remember how many units you have before you get over near a car even days later so I thought forget it so I don't take a tipple now take a wee hot chocolate about half nine on a Friday night so there you are that's you up to date hello Scotty says Julie Shaw hello Julie I hope you're well lovely to have you with us and of course we're live on Facebook live that is the big one the one everyone's watching the one everyone is talking about can we share 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 share, share. otherwise I shall have to dash and uh, Nation Radio 96.3 on the FM for those of you who are asking 
Hello, says Ian Hales. Hello, Ian. There's Kevin McDee, dinky do big man. And uh, National Radio is a breath of fresh air. I get it in Livingston. Nation Radio, 96.3 FM. You'll get it clear as a bell in Livingston. Of course, a very fine station. Put it on just as soon as I've finished. You're on the radio tonight, this is Julie Shaw. Of course, Julie. I definitely am. Good evening, Scotty, from uh, Alan McCauley in Bonnie Kelso. Lovely Kelso. What a fine part. The square there. Floors Castle, of course, doing at the Kelso. Uh, hello, big man, says Christopher Love. Dinky do, Christopher. Lovely to have you with us. Welcome, welcome. Colin Roger, how are you? Good to have you with us as well. And Welcome. It's Friday evening, and as you well know, nothing gets past me. Good. I'll have a listen, says Julie. You'd better, Julie. And have a wee phone in and have a chit chat. Gail Thompson, George Clark. Did you get your haggis, says Graham Broadley? Well, no, but we can get a vegetarian haggis these days, I've noticed, which is absolutely outstanding. Uh, have you noticed this week one or two cheeky, cheeky people uh, on McClure's Facebook pages? Excellent. Scotty, this breakfast. Brexit stuff is doing my head in right now. I'm fed up hearing about it, says Makir Pevera. I think what they should do, Makir, is um, first thing on Monday morning, ring up the EU and say, listen, I know we've laughed about a bit and mucked you all around, but could we come back in on a full-time basis? Uh, because that referendum that we did was really just an opinion poll. There was a lot of duff information about, and um, a lot of people who want to leave the EU are kind of xenophobic characters who um, are a bit idealistic. They've been uh, watching too much Land of Hope and Glory stuff and um, all that kind of idea, and they're not looking at the big picture. So therefore, can we come back in full time to the EU? And uh, obviously we haven't left yet, so there's nothing to worry about. And would you mind? And we'll send you a note to that effect and rescind Article 50. And of course, apologies for any mucking about. That kind of thing would be quite nice, wouldn't it? Send that in and uh, see what's what. Uh, Grim Body, Scott, can you not get us snow? Uh, says Graham. Snow. Uh, Thomas Hamilton says, Scotty is 96.3 FM, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, 10 to midnight. Phone number 0141811-0475. Excellent. The good thing about Brexit is more fish suppers to John Cameron. See, the blinders back. That's more important than politics, says um Tommy Jordan. So there we are. I don't know what you're referring to, Tommy, there. So you must be talking a lot of nonsense. Uh, Fred Walton, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us and excellent stuff. I hope you're well, Fred. We haven't heard from you for some time. So we could go back to the EU and say, just to let you know we're staying. And that would put us in a very, very powerful position, of course, because we could actually say um, we call the shots on the deal of coming back, though. You know, if you want us to stay, we have to call the shots. Yellowfish, says Graham Broadley. Yes, don't eat yellowfish, um, uh, is what the Eskimos learn. At least I think that's what they said. Maybe it was something else. Um, oh, no, it was don't eat yellow snow. Sorry about that. That was what they were saying to the Eskimos. Yes, I beg your pardon. The yellowfish, fine. Of course, you're talking haddock. Haddock there, the haddock. Is haddock a yellow fish, would you say? Elizabeth Campbell, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Scotty McClure and the Friday night pop-up. This is the big one. The one everyone's talking about. The one everyone is watching. Share, 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 share. Thank you very much for all your shares last week. Many, many thousands have seen the broadcast and we like that so there we are so many many thousands watching scotty mcclue popping up and seeing dinky do uh, shall we have some sharing are you in a mood for sharing that's the stuff i can't see this thing's too far away to actually share i would need to reach out and bring it over uh, brill says graham broadly absolutely graham never a dull moment what scotty mcclue's about as we all well know McIntyre Dominic is watching Dinky Do. McIntyre Dominic, good to have you with us. I suspect your name 
might be the other way around. But uh, come and join us. Uh, everybody share, 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 share. Mark Higgins, lovely to have you with us as well. And we're going to be doing some add-ons with the old Facebook so there's exciting things happen. And then three nights on the radio, Friday night, Saturday night, Sunday night, 96.3 on the FM. Always good stuff, I say. I must uh, let you know what's happening on here. Kevin McDade says, great to have you back. Breath of fresh air, proper DJ, who talks sense. Dig you do. Hey, Scotty, I think we should uh, pack in this international football lark. It's become a total fast now. Why don't we go back to just, you know, playing the old games for fun? Why do footballers need millions and millions of pounds? Why not just go back and say it should be a privilege to play for your country and we might be able to find you 10 grand uh, a year. I can't see where to share, says Julie Shaw. Julie Shaw, it should say down to the right hand side, you should have three buttons. So you should have like, comment and share. And uh, the share one is where you go click, click, clickety, click, clickety, clickety, click. And that is McClue shared. And that just lets everybody know we're on. I should have brought up my device. I don't think I've got my other device with me. Otherwise, we could have got on with that. Bottom of the page, says Graham Broadley. Absolutely, Graham. Never a dull moment. Can everybody else start sharing? I'll see if I can get into this, and that will give us a wee start here. There we are. Excellent. Sorry, am I disappearing when I do that? Hi, Scott. This is Paul McGuinness. Hi, Paul. Welcome, 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 I say. And dinky-doo. Where are you watching from, Paul? Let's all know. Very, very important. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. That Scotty McClure is live just for you on his Friday night pop-up. This is the big one. But we do need to get sharing. Craig Gallagher, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us now. Here I am. We will get there. Do not worry. Do not panic. There's never any. Don't. Don't panic. That's what I always say. Did you get your shares at the bottom of the page? See how you go. And I'll put this one out to the nation. There we go. Lovely, lovely, lovely. And uh, Friday friends, wonderful. We'll do that. And I shall do a bit of sharing now. So that's me sharing. You'll see me disappear a wee bit to the side, but that's me doing a bit of sharing just to get you all sorted out. Hi, Scotty. All the best. This is Christopher and you. Dinky do, Christopher. Love to hear from you, Paul McGuinness. You're the absolute best. Top man, Paul. Dinky do. Frosty night tonight, somebody's telling us. Aha. Share to a page. I'm going to share to the McLeod page and let you all know what's happening. Dinky do, then it's up there. Wonderful stuff. Live, yes, we'll let them know we're live. And um, well, they can see we're live. We'll just do that. They can all see we're live, for goodness sake. And they can come and join us. And they also, I'll share to a group, if that's all right. So there you are, a bit more sharing going on. It's quite funny, I can see myself popping to the side there to do all the sharing. Share button showing, good, have you got it? That's what we need, and I shall share to a group. I'll let everybody know in the Scotty McClure group that we're live, and they can come and join us here as well. Set your notifications. Let me know when Scotty McClure goes live so that you never, ever, ever miss a second of Scotty McClure. Very, very important. Colin Devine, uh, Frosty Night tonight, Long John's in, and a wee dram, says Graham Broadley. Well, I might be doing the Long John's, but not the wee dram. Share button showing now, that's it done, says Julie. One of your books has just fallen off the shelf behind you, says McHare. Don't panic about it, there's plenty more. And uh, who have we got? Scotty, what's your thoughts on Brexit? Should we invoke Article 50? and leave the union. We've already, I think, invoked it. What we should do is revoke it and rescind it and stay in the union. I uh, got engaged last week. Shout out to I'm Gail George Clark and Gail. Happy, happy, happy announcement. Share, says Grimrity. Evening, Scotty, says the wonderful Tony Mac. Hedley McCarthy is watching. And Mark Jones, dinky do. Mark Jones, wonderful stuff. Is that the Mark Jones, I ask you? He's waving to us. We shall no doubt find out. I can't see because it's too tiny. The writing and the pictures are too tiny on my wonderful device. But there it goes. Let's have more sharing. Where else are we sharing? 
um, share to a group. So we shall share to some groups wonderful stuff. We like that, and we let them know what's happening. Done it, says Thomas Hamilton. Thank you, Tom. Much appreciated. We need to get these numbers up. So there we are. We've only got a trickle. We've only got a trickle in here at the moment, so we need to get the big numbers up. So what I shall do, um, I'll put in here the E, and that should come up. There we are. Wonderful. And we'll sure share that now. And I'll just pop this in. Excuse me a, a, a wee second. Just excuse me a wee second, folks. Wonderful. Live now. Live now. There we are. Excellent stuff. And we'll just post that. And that goes up. And that lets everybody know what is what. We won't panic. That somewhat disheveled shelf. Scotty, nothing disheveled. About it. Good to see. I know where everything is. I can put my hand on it. Where is it? Tweet to see. So don't panic, Paul McGuinness. Uh, Marie Sellers, welcome, welcome, welcome. Lovely to have you with us. And a very, very big dinky do from me, Scotty McClue. That's what it's all about. I'll just do some more sharing. You must excuse me. Because you all need to share as well. There we are. Share, 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 share. Keith Thompson, a very warm welcome. You're all watching Scotty McClure on the Friday night pop-up just before you go for your tea. Uh, go for your tea, go for your evening meal, go and dress for dinner, have a pre-prandial in the ante room. Anything at all, it all goes well on McClue on Facebook Live just for you, Dinky Doon. Of course, this is only, as a lot of you well know, a tiny part of the story because we're live on a massive, massive radio station Friday nights, Saturday nights, Sunday nights, 10 o'clock sharp through until midnight, only two hours of superb scintillating information, education and entertainment for the nation. Excellent. And of course, right now, we're broadcasting live not just to one nation, but to many, many, many nations. You can see me in America. You can see me in Canada. So there we are. So do let us know where you're watching. A lot of people watch in Australia, Australia and New Zealand. So there you are. Yes, yeah, South and North Island. So if you're watching in Auckland, let us know. If you're watching in Wellington or Christchurch, do let us know. Dinky do. Scotty McClue, this is the big one just for you. And uh, who else have we got on here? Scotty, you're looking for a cleaner. I'm good at the high dusting, says McHale. I know, I'll need to get down to it myself, though. I'm just going to tidy everything up. Having a night off from the drink, I'm getting older now. Looking forward to your radio show tonight, says Tony Mack. Well, of course, you can always watch and have a light refreshment, Tony. The two are not mutually exclusive. And you might want to give me a wee call later on 0141811 That's the telephone number for the wonderful Nation Radio. And uh, 96.3 on the FM or www nationradio.scot stick your television off at 10 o'clock sharp uh, so there you are hi from Canada says Karen Bennett Karen Bennett dinky do whereabouts in Canada are you do let us know so we can uh, see what's what and share with everybody in Canada talk to your 10 pal says Thomas Hamilton dinky do Tom lovely to have you with us uh, my daughter's in Auckland Scotty I miss her millions I get to see her once a year says Scott Biddy what to do is send her a text now and say, are you watching Scotty McClure live on Facebook? And the two of you can keep in touch via the Scotty McClure pop-up. How about that for a bit of dinky-doo? Aha, you see, I'm not just a pretty face, you know. I know all these things, so they are Scott BD. So get in touch with your daughter right now. See if she can find us. We're born for a few minutes yet, and we can see... What is what? Wonderful Richie McCusker, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I see. How's that, Scotty? Says Richie. Dinky do, Richie. Good to have you with us. Marvellous stuff. Billy Hunter's watching. Come and join us, Billy. I'm just going to do a little bit more sharing, if that's all right, folks. Uh, this time we'll share with another group. 
So share with that. Share to the Scotty McClue group as well. Those of you that are in the Scotty McClue group, you can all get sharing to that particular group. I did a watch party the other night. They're rather fun. So there we go. Right to a group. And uh, we'll share to Scotty McClue. Uh, we'll do that right now. SC. That should come up. Sorry if I keep disappearing. Back in a minute. There we are. Scotty McClue fan group. And they've got it right now so they know we're live how fabulous is that uh, she's still in bed at 6 25 a.m over there all right scott fair enough well get her uh, to talk to you on the um the show tonight we can do a hookup uh, that would be rather marvelous we could do a hookup with auckland on the radio show tonight uh scotty the first lady here she's got the hot you. Thank you, Michael. Appreciate it. Uh, you're shared to my uh, 3,000 friends, but none of them invite me out for pizza. Well, this is it. You know, I mean, somebody's very upset. <coughs> Family funeral and said he said he had thousands of friends on Facebook and they didn't turn up to the funeral. So, you know, that sort of thing. But no, that's lovely. Share, Paul. Get me out to all your friends there and let them know that Scotty McClure is live. Dinky do to every single one of you. A lot of people will have stopped off for a swift one on the way home. So uh, they're not watching right now, but don't worry about that. That's not a problem to us. Whatever time McClue pops up, there's always a wee audience there. There's a few of us, uh, which is fabulous. And uh, then it gets shared out and everybody gets to hear. So tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Scotty McClue, live just for you. Dinky do. Uh, I think Theresa May's song should be, should I stay or should I go? So they are by the clash. Do you think she should go? Uh, why should she go, for goodness sake? She's done an outstanding job. Fantastic. Two and a half years down the line, and we've still managed to remain in the EU. I think that's terrific. I really do. So you can't say fairer than that unless you can't pronounce your Fs or your THs. I think the thing is that a lot of the politicians, uh, they've, they've got their head um, you know, pressed right to the grindstone, and they're not realizing the big picture is that we, uh, you know, only take that as a, you know, take that as a guide, that uh, EU referendum. It's not the will of the people at all, because uh, there's 70 million people and 17 million voted to leave. Now, Scotty, can you say a big hello to Annette Hunter? I'm converting her to the Scotty McClure Show. This is Billy Annette Hunter. I say not just hello, but dinky-doo from Scotty McClure to everyone and uh, also to you. Excellent. So there you are, Annette Hunter. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Come and enjoy the Scotty McClure pop-ups on Facebook Live. And, of course, come and enjoy the Scotty McClure Show on a Friday, Saturday, and Sunday for two hours of superb scintillating information, education, and entertainment live on Nation Radio. Fantastic stuff. That's what it's all about, I say. More sharing. Can we all share, 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 share. I look a bit ruddy in the coupon there. I'm just having a wee look. Looks a wee bit ruddy in the coupon. We'll share to... Um, Show to another group, show to another page. What have we got here? Fantastic stuff. Timeline. Right, where are we going? We're off to a group, aren't we? Share to a group. Share to share an event. Now, I don't want to share an event. I want to share to a group. Fantastic. Can everybody get sharing when I disappear there? Bonjour, everybody, Matros. Guess who's back? Scotty's back. Robert McHardy. Dinky do. And uh, love to Montrose up there. What a lovely, lovely part of the world. Share in a group, the world. Did you like that? That had a kind of Persia ring to Perth. So they are wonderful. That's what we like. Maybe more Montrose, actually. It may have had a ring of Montrose. I'm just going to do this. Get that going. There we are. Excellent stuff. And sending it out to the groups. There we go. Live. And uh, I'll just pop live up. L-I-V-E. Good. That's gone. And I've shared. Fantastic stuff. If you can all do the same. Uh, wish Nicola wouldn't use our remain vote as an excuse to push for our dream of breaking up the UK. 
Uh, Charles Thompson, it's nothing to do with that. The uh, breaking up the UK is as a direct result of this whole Brexit thing and the way Scotland has been treated since the referendum. So, uh, you know, that's nothing to do with the Scots, the breakup of the UK. If that happens, that will happen anyway because of the way they've gone about with the whole Brexit thing. So you can chill about that and not point any fingers. They are excellent stuff. Scotty, have you had your teeth whitened? They're off the offy whites. Look here, that's my original teeth at the age of 34. I still have my own teeth and hair. How fantastic is that lovely big shock of dark hair under here, as you all well know. Uh, so there we go, no whitening at all, no nothing, just a, a good brush, uh, morning and evening, excellent stuff, give myself a freshen up, you know, <laughs> wonderful, and uh, Nick's watching, Kevin Walker's watching, thank you do, lovely to have you with us, we'll give Kevin a wee wave, we can give people a wave, and that is excellent, tell 10 to tell 10, come on guys, you should be sharing and sharing and sharing, and uh, tap, 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 on the screen, let folks know what's happening, sharing all the time, if everybody shares, I mean if you've shared a few thousand, share again, let them know, there's Neil Hallgate, dinky do Neil, lovely to have you with us, Scotty McClure, for a Friday evening pop-up, the world's top broadcaster, and the first lord of the internet, so there we are, Charles Thompson, thank you very much, uh, don't try that at home now folks, that was for entertainment purposes only, Scotty, long time no here, glad to your dulcet tones. I've been away for far too many years, says Mark Hampshire. Oh no, I think I've been away for too many years. Yes, well I haven't been far away. I'm always working somewhere, but you don't necessarily hear me in Scotland. Now you can hear me right across central Scotland. It's worth noting the majority of Scottish and Northern Irish people wanted to stay in the EU, but were outvoted by the rest of England and Wales. Yes, I think a lot of people voted leave because they thought genuinely that that money would go to the NHS. They didn't realise it was Duff Gen. So there we go. Scotty McClure, says Christine Garvin. Dinky do, Christine. Always lovely to have you with us. And lots and lots of sharing. Can we have more sharing, please? More telling 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. That Scotty McClure is live on the big one. Facebook Live. The Friday evening pop-up. The tea time pop-up. Just to say hi to all of you. And we will be sending this round and round and round. Very, very important. Lots of shares. Wonderful James Allison's watching. Dink you do, James. Hope all's well with you from me, Scotty McClue. Come and join us, I say. Get yourselves a little bit of a shout out. You're always very welcome. And as I say, thanks for all your sharing during the week. Terrific job. Many, many thousands have seen the pop-ups on Facebook Live. Julie Shaw says, I'll listen on tonight on Nation Radio. I'm away to feed the dugs. Ta-ta for now. Love to the dugs, Julie Shaw. And ta-ta for now. I hope they're getting something nice and nutritious. The tails will be wagging. Uh, so there we are. Thanks, Julie. Hello, says Kevin McDavid. Dinky do Kevin McDavid. So there we are. So with Kevin McDade earlier, and now we've got Kevin McDavid. So that's excellent. Uh, I think Dinky do is Cockney slang for twenty two. No, not at all, Tony Mac. Far from it. Dinky do was the Emperor Zero, one of the Roman emperors, who put his hand up when they were all walking back to Italy. Walking back to Italy. I think we need another vote. It's kind of went pear-shaped. Philip Monroe, it's not went pear-shaped. It's gone pear-shaped. So there you are. Should we stay or should we leave? I think we should definitely stay. Hem, love you doll. Get a shout out to Gareth, my BF. Gareth Owen, says Christine Garvin. Christine Garvin, think you do a uh, consider it done. Uh, Kevin McDavid, yes, yes. What's for tea tonight, Scotty? I've had... Burger and chips, says Machair Pedra. I'm at the boiled eggs tonight, Machair. So a bit of excitement there. Excellent stuff. Can we get more sharing and sharing and sharing? And sharing and sharing and sharing. Scotty McClure, the first lord of the internet and the world's top broadcaster has popped up to say dinky do to every single one of you. So come and share. Scotty, thanks for correcting me. Not at all, Tony. 
I look after you, you see. I make sure that you get everything right because you're a very clever man and a very good broadcaster. So there we are. So we're just keeping you up to date there. That's what it's all about. Uh, right. Um, to your devices, share, 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 share. People should be getting the massage now. I'll do another wee share uh, to another group, let you know what's happening. As I say, I look a bit ruddy in the visage tonight. That's a bit strange. I'm not sure quite why that is, because uh, I look fine on this. Do I look okay or do I look a little bit ruddy in the coupon? Uh, so there we go. Always looking after the wonderful people who look after me. There you are. That's what it's all about. And I voted to stay in the EU, says Christine. Well, yes. I mean, it doesn't really matter how people voted two and a half years ago because there's every chance they'll have changed their mind now after they've seen the pantomime and the carry on that's been on. Uh, Craigie Boy McCormick. So there we go. Craigie Boy McCormick. Not sure about that comment there. Yes. Keep the union rule, Britannia, Scotty. No, no, Britannia's had its whack. So there you are, says Craig. If it's not actually serving Scotland well, we're paying far too much. Scotland's sending 40, 50 billion a year down to Westminster for squandering. Thank you, Scotty, for your kind words. God bless and much love. I thank you, Tony Mack, and dinky do to you, my dear fellow. Alan Humphreys is watching. First time Facebook Live. I've tried to call before. They couldn't get through on Nation Radio. Love to have heard you. Do you have any pets? Why, why not? Of course I've got pets, Louise. I've got uh, Louise Arrell on here. What a fine name. Any connection to the late Sir William Arrell? I say, uh, that's, that's what it's all about. Um, no, I've got, uh, the Black Labrador Dog. So there you are. Wonderful Bordex. So there we are, says McKeer. Uh, McKeer, how very coarse. He's suggesting that the bald eggs may make McClue windy. Don't be silly. How very coarse. People are at their tea now. Come on. We're guests to people's house. Wonderful Jim Thompson has joined us. Dinky do, Jim. Hi, Scotty. I don't know if you remember me. And Donna Kebab, her dog tried to eat my cat. We used to phone you all the time. Hope you're well. Great to hear your voice again. Sharon, phone us tonight, 10 o'clock sharp. Come on for a chit chat. Hi, pal from Big Jim, Jim Thompson. Dinky do to you, I say. Always lovely to hear from you. Panto, Mola Circus, says Christine McGarry, the Brexit Circus of the Brexit Pantomime. Absolutely incredible, wonderful stuff. I listen in, in the mornings, and uh, before I go over to Nation Radio in the morning, I'll sometimes take a quick listen to see what's happening with the politics. Uh, Ernie Ross, thank you, dear. Lovely to have you with us, and a very warm welcome. Excellent, that's what it is. No, no, the um, union may have served as well in the past, but I think it's kind of had its day. Scotland needs to um, get its stuff together. That's not to say what I thought would be a wonderful idea. Uh, England leaves, Scotland stays in the European Union, and England and Wales trade via Scotland with the European Union. There's a thought. I remember when fellow Scots didn't call each other unions or nets. It was before the SNP. Now we're a divided nation. Well, the SNP has been around since 1932. Pardon me, I'm just rubbing my eye a little bit. You shouldn't really do this. Don't do that at home, folks. You'll make it sore. Uh, so we're not actually a divided nation, Charles. There's no problem about it at all. Uh, and we mustn't be divided. The Scots stick together 100%. But I think we fell at the last fence at the referendum because they brought up an ex-Prime Minister and an ex-Chancellor uh, to talk... Um, to the Scots about staying and all that and panicked a lot of the oldies about their pension things, which was just a nonsense. It really was. So there you are. And uh, Raymond Benson, James Kelly, Dinky Do, Scotty, this is Raymond, Dinky Do, Raymond. Lovely to have you with us. Uh, Ernie Ross says, oh, damn, what a fright I got. It's the man himself. It is Scotty McClue just popping up just for you. Right, can everybody do a bit more sharing? Come on. 
want to see these numbers popping up? So there you are. And uh, I don't care if you got fright early, Ross, you can handle all that. You're a tough guy. Uh, sorry, we are a divided nation, Sir Charles Thompson. Not at all, Charles. We we'll only um, have different opinions, but we're certainly not a divided nation. It's a bit like when somebody brings up Celtic and Rangers and says they're different, uh, they're connected to different religions. They're not uh, at all. They're football clubs. So there you are. And there is only one religion that, uh, that the two of them were originally connected with. So there you are. One religion. Hi, Scotty. Please wish Arlene Armstrong a happy 50th birthday, says the wonderful Andy Seger. Is always very good with a smart comment, our Andy. Aren't you, Andy? Dinky do, I say. Uh, don't ever disappear, Scotty. You're a bloody legend, so you are, says my care. Oh, you said a B word on here. Uh, only because of the oil. If it's not for our oil. It is. It is our oil. And uh, that'll all come back, of course. They've just discovered another uh, 50 million barrels or something like that. So there you are. So there's always going to be plenty of oil flowing until it runs out. There we are. And then we will see what is what. So uh, Scotland's got lots and lots and lots of assets and, of course, supports the South with its assets. And, uh, you know, we've been very happy to do that. But, I mean, the problem is that uh, I think it was Margaret Thatcher came and asset stripped Scotland, took a lot of money to London to make London look big and strong, and we need to get that money back into Scotland. Hello, thanks, Scotty. You're a star, says Andy Seager. Not at all. So are you, Andy Seager. Yes, actually, amazing. You mention it. It's on the £5 note, my claim to fame. Check out my photography page if you'd like a calendar for 2019. I'll hook you up. Much love. And if you have a can't press C more, because uh, I might lose the broadcast. Uh, do we get our king and queen back? Yes, Craigie boy, of course, absolutely. What people don't realise, there's no connection with the royal household and independence for Scotland. Independence for Scotland is economic and political, and uh, the monarchy is not. Nothing to do with it. No connection. It's all these half-witted idiots that do the monarchy down and say, oh, ridiculous. the monarchy cost us a maximum of 60 pence a year, Right? and uh, bring in billions and billions to the economy. So never, ever, 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 ever diss the royal family. I put up this week, happy birthday to His Royal Highness, the Prince of Wales, and I had so many half-witted idiots trying to diss the Prince of Wales. Shocking, shocking, shocking. Uh, so there we are. So our king and queen are always there. Do not worry. And Her Majesty and Prince Philip would be wonderful custodians of the Scottish crown. How mild is it just now? Hope it's not the calm before the storm. And in fact, Her Majesty the Queen and Prince Philip already are custodians and curators of the Scottish crown. I uh, hope it's not the calm before the storm. I hope not, my hair. I hope we don't get the big freeze, but we'll no doubt find out. How's the time looking? Has anybody got the time on them till I see what's going on here? in case McClure has to go at some point. Uh, but yes, very, 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 very mild and very lovely, I think. So there we are. I'll just do another share, uh, let you all know what's happening. What's the time there? Can anybody see that? Oh, I can't see. I had to lean forward to see um, the time. Uh, 1841, says Johnny MacDonald. Was this the year you were born, Johnny? Are you one of the original McDonald's of Glencoe? Oh, no, sorry, it's the time. There's Raymond Benson. He's put a nice colon between the 18 and the 42. So that means it's 1842, which, of course, is 18 minutes to 7. There we are. Excellent. So I'd better push off quite soon and let you get on. But remember, I'm on tonight, 10 o'clock sharp on Nation Radio, the world's top broadcaster and the first lord of the internet. Tony Mac, I'm not the biggest fan of the royal family. Well, you need to get out more, Tony Mac. But Prince Charles deserves some credit for his hospice and charity work. Fantastic. The whole lot of them deserve credit. Duke of Edinburgh's award scheme, the youngsters that have benefited 
from the royal family. Listen, the new monarchy, the modern monarchy is very, very cool. Do rigueur. Nobody should ever, ever, ever diss the royal family. So if your head says you're not a fan of the royal family, get yourself out more and get sorted. Start looking into it and change your game. Up your game, I say. Raise your game, I say. 6.43, says Christine Garvin. What I'll do, Christine? I'll press on till about 6.45 and then I'll have to dash and let you all get your evening meal, your tea, your supper, uh, get dressed for dinner, have a pre-perennial, uh, a pre-perennial in the ante room before you go to dinner. Uh, we want Scotland's king and queen back. Scottish, we want them. Yeah, they're, well, they're back, Piggy boy. No worries about that. You panic too much. Got to go now, Scotty. Uh, Jack, my dog, wants his dinner. Is he a Jack Russell? By any chance, McCare. Is he called after the parson? Parson Jack Russell, who are these lovely wee terriers. I think they originally, there was a Lakeland terrier in there as well. Was that right? Have I got that right? <coughs> oh, you dog people will know what is what. Right, i better push off, let you all go. it be lovely to be with you. Charles Thompson, think of the show I missed tonight. Uh, if it's about supporting breaking up the UK, no thanks. Charles Thompson, the breakup of the UK uh, will just happen, so don't try and guilt trip me by saying you'll give the show a miss. You will listen to every single breath of mine on that show. All right? Especially if you're having to learn about what is what. McClure can show you things that you can only imagine. So there you are, Charles. So stop being silly. I think I'll take my ball inside and uh, pop it. I uh, look forward to hearing you on the radio tonight. Weekends are not complete without you on the wireless, says Tony Mac. Ridiculous nonsense there, Charles. Freedom, says Craigie Boy. Okay, have fun tonight. I'll be listening, says Christine Garvin. Good, good, because Charles will definitely be listening. He never misses a second of Scotty McClue. Right, I'll sing the song. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. Of wit or zane, au revoir, and a cheerio. See you all later, dinky-doo-loves. ta la -las.